How to Flow Floor Exercises with Tamara Ronkin, MindBodyNow.com. Let's start by centering. Close the eyes. Inhale through the nose and out through the nose. Inhaling, our left arm reaches back. Exhaling, and it draws forward. Inhaling the right arm back. Exhaling forward. Continuing at your own pace. Inhaling back. Exhaling forward. Bringing our hands onto the knees. Inhale and look up. Exhale, we lean back. Inhaling, arching the spine. Exhaling as we round, chin toward the chest. Continuing to inhale and arch. Exhale and round. Shrugging shoulders up and releasing. Inhale up, let them go. Inhale up, rolling back, forward, up and back. Releasing tension off the neck and shoulders. Inhale up, exhale, chin toward our chest. Inhaling, rolling chin up to the right shoulder. Exhaling as the chin rolls across the chest, rising to the other side. Exhaling the chin across and continuing at our own perfect pace, releasing tension as we roll from side to side. From here, release the feet in front of us and bring the hands behind, fingers pointing toward the feet. Inhale, open the throat. Exhale, chin toward the chest. Inhale, lifting into tabletop pose. Exhaling to lower the tailbone. Again, inhaling, rise. Exhaling, release. We can add leg lifts for more challenge or continue with both feet on the ground, inhaling to rise, exhaling to lower. From here, we put the right foot inside the left thigh and begin to stretch the wrists, folding fingers into the palm. Moving to the other hand. Switch legs and now we'll extend the wrists. Fingers point down and we're pressing them away. lower down to our back body to prepare for flowing bridge pose. Feet are hip distance apart, knees aligned over the ankles, rolling up through the back body, walking shoulders under, and then start lowering and lifting one vertebra at a time if we can. Bridge pose. Release the arms, stretch overhead, the back body lowers, Inhale and sweep up from the pelvis up to the heart, the hands lower. Release the arms overhead. Inhale and roll up to 
the bridge pose. Exhale, release the back body and draw the knees into the chest. Knees to chest pose, rocking side to side. From here, holding the right knee into the chest, either on the shin or behind the thigh, pressing the left heel away. If we'd like more challenge, we can exhale to crunch and lift. Inhale, release the effort, exhale, lifting the left leg and the forehead draws toward the knee. Inhale, let it go, exhaling to crunch and lift. Inhaling, let it go and repeat, exhale to crunch. Now switching legs, we draw the left knee in and the right leg extends. Gently hugging the knee into the chest. On the exhale, it comes closer. And on the inhale, it releases just a little bit. Same option on this side. Exhaling to crunch and lift. Inhaling to release if you would like to feel more. This creates more strength for the legs and for the abdominals. Both knees into the chest. Now the soles of the feet come together, the knees open outward. Butterfly pose on our back. We inhale, sweeping arms back, exhale, and we reach the hands between the knees. Inhale, full range of motion in the shoulders, exhale, and we reach. Inhale, stretch it back. If you'd like to feel more work in the abdominals, we're lifting the feet toward the hands, lifting both ends of the body to create more strength in the midsection. comfortable easy seated pose we inhale the left arm back the right hand presses the left knee down and away inhale lifting and we exhale to twist Preparing for the other side, we inhale and the right arm reaches up, places behind us, and the left hand pushes the right knee down and away. Each inhale, we're lifting through the crown of the head, and on the exhale, we're twisting to the right. Come on to the knees and we can choose to stay right here, close the eyes and breathe for a few minutes before transitioning back into our day. I hope you enjoyed Hot the Flow Floor Exercises with Tamara Ronkin, mindbodynow.com. <laughs>